Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Super Nintendo Sunday's Illusion of Gaia. Meant to put up some content in the past couple weeks, still trying to figure out what I'm going to do with Link to the Past and Yoshi's Island. No being done. So, in the meantime, enjoy this, and I will have probably new stuff for you in a week to replace. I have ideas. Not exactly sure what I'm going to do. But uh, yeah, last time we checked out the Nazca lines and we were teleported to this sky garden, which is, I believe, kind of sacred to the moon tribe. They're here. We meet again. Q -q -q. If you love Kukukuin, consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. You're a strong boy to have come this far. Thank you very much. The sky garden is our mode of transportation. Four crystal balls in four locations. Find each one in clockwise order. Don't tell me what to do. You don't actually have to do that. Drop off the cliff at the front end, at the front and back. To find the upside down world. Okay, great. Let's go explore. We are not equipped. Uh oh. Yeah, so this is um this is a weird dungeon. Uh a lot of balls. It's a lot of balls. Hopefully you're into that. Also, we had a really nice amount of orbs for a bit. There's these um kind of weird golem 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 things. Um, that are everywhere. So there's, uh, a lot of balls, a lot of robots. Hopefully you're into that. These guys shoot laser beams and rocket arms. Rock them, sock them robots, perhaps? Nothing is too hard to dispatch here. We're relatively strong. As they told us before, we're a strong boy. We're eating our Wheaties. And you can dodge the rocket arms pretty easily, too. Um, as you can see, they kind of just fire in one direct pattern. So just scoot. Just get yourself scooting out of the way. Deal with these weird... Nerd ropes here. And as you can see, enemy variety at a premium here. As per usual. Uh, don't get used to seeing too much more than this, because it really isn't. Once again, make use of the jump attack with your flute. You can use your skin flute to attack the balls. To much aplomb, it'll do very good things for you. This this dungeon's real weird. Um, I'm going to try to go through it quickly. Because if I remember correctly, it's really long and hard. And no, it's not really that difficult. Um... But, you know, you will see um, a lot of, it's very samey. And you'll have to do plenty of this gimmick where once you explore an entire area, the game kind of funnels you upside down. Whoa! And now we can go in the back door. Wow. Viewers. If you couldn't handle blue robots, can you handle orange robots? And I think these, um, these balls boys are a little different. I don't think anything really hurts you as it falls, but it is really easy to avoid the hitboxes of pretty much everything. These guys, well, I say that as I get hit. I think those robots have homing capabilities when they're firing their lasers. So I guess it's like, oh, those do hurt you. I have been wrong twice in the span of about five seconds. Good for me. So just be careful. Whoa. Oh, maybe they're not homing. Maybe they just kind of retract and then come in hot. Don't really care for any of that. I'm not sure how that happened. I don't remember touching that one. Those balls were not swatted by me. But you gotta get out of the way. Oof. I'm just taking damage left and right here. Hopefully there is a... What is the point of this? Hopefully there is a Healy Bailey somewhere near B. Because I am just... Oof. I am just really getting hammered here. I don't think stuff in here is inherently stronger, but... I did just get another life. Which I have not used them yet. It's a good chance that's going to happen. Because I am just getting my poo pushed in right here. Yeah, you just got to... Well, this guy's easy pickings. Boop, got him. 
But yeah, the music doesn't change. The enemies are all, uh, oof, very much the same. So hopefully you enjoy this. You get light blue land, dark blue land. Uh, pick which flavor of balls you want. I'm gonna run. Get away from me. Oof. Yeah, it doesn't really seem like you get much in the way. Oh, I didn't know that you could do that. Do I have a, an herb? Herb? I do. I have a lot. Let's go ahead and do this. Whoop. Take the medicine. Okay, that's about half health. We'll take it. I don't really want to get, you know, used to doing that. Ooh. I, ooh, we got a defense upgrade. That's cool. Honestly, with how poorly I've been playing lately, that would be very useful. Woo! I don't know what the hitbox is. Not, sorry. I don't know what the range is of those things. Um, I probably would want to... If there's another... I would really love something else to heal me. I don't know if that's going to be an option. I honestly don't even know where I'm going, so... Is this cool? Ooh, there's a chest here. <gasps> Herb. That's actually really convenient. I did not will that into existence. I did not know that was there. Trust me. If your first thought at any point when I'm playing this game is, yeah, he knows what he's doing. He's just messing with us. The answer to that is absolutely not. This game, thankfully, is relatively logical in the way that it's laid out. To a fault. I think that that makes it pretty boring sometimes. Um, and I can definitely say for certain that we are not, this is not going to be a one and, ooh, this is health. Eight, ooh. Yeah, I probably should have just waited. Oops. Um, ooh, this is annoying. Yeah, these guys are buns. How do we, how do I hurt you? Okay. Oh, is it just the sword? Do I hit the sword? What did that do? Okay, then can I attack you? Can I move you? Can I get it? Okay, is this good? Ooh! It's the orb! All right, so as far as I know, That's the first, so we're gonna definitely need um, more of that. Three of them, in fact. So I definitely am not gonna finish the Sky Garden today. That'd be crazy. Um, I would say we are going to do half. How's that sound? And then we can um, We can finish the other half of it because the other half obviously is going to have um, the boss of this area in it too. So uh, viewers, you're going to get your money's worth. All right. Now let's see if I can navigate back to the future. I don't, this looks sort of familiar. There we go. All right. So we can put the first orb in there. Nope. You got to equip it. Items are useless unless equipped. The crystal ball is set in the hole. All right, so that's kind of what you do. And then if you want to, which I'm going to every time because I'm stupid, uh, smart and stupid. I'm gonna go in here, have Gaia help us, record. Be very careful here. Yes, continue your journey. If you say no, then the game just puts you in limbo. And then you get to hear that really good Earth and Womb song, but then there's only so much doom, 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 doom you can take. So, anyway, back to it. We have to go in clockwise order according to the game. You don't actually have to do that. You can do it in any order that you want to, but for once in my gosh dang life, you know, I'm being very reckless. Um, maybe we'll do things in ten. Ooh, look at this. You don't see this animation very often. Also, is he wearing a shirt over a shirt? Or does his shirt just have different colored sleeves? Get out of the way. 
I like the design of the robots. Um, I don't quite... See, that's the thing that throws me off. Should I go out of the way? Is the enemies don't really fit the environment. I don't quite understand what the point of any of it is. Haha, how's that feel? Alright, and that guy just turns to stone or something? I don't know. Is there anything else up here? No, very cool. I think that's pretty much it for that spot. We need to go up top here and run, 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 run. Okay, so. Oop. Okay. Well, there's something behind this boy. I see it. I, I don't see it. Smack, 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 smack in your feet. Come on, one more. Let's go. Today. Today, Junior. Really? Four hits? I apologize for this. Is very. Oh, there's more than that. Why? Why is, why is that with more than four? Is it... S Wow, that was incredibly annoying. Okay, we can't... Okay, that's what I just said. Okay, we can move this one. Before we take out the Squirtle Snake. Done. What is in here? Ooh, a dark space. Healing and freed in? Mm. Heck yes, it's time for freed in. Prepare yourselves. Oh, it doesn't automatically heal you. That's BS. Continue your journey. Yes. Just watch your button mash and you don't want to wind up goofing. But yes, now I have Frieden. This is very cool. I'm very happy about that. Uh, okay, moving on. I think I've basically done every everything I need to do. I'm assuming that Frieden is stronger than Will. I think he is. He has more reach. We have a cool range attack. Remember that? Boom! That's cool, huh? It's that Dark Friar attack. I haven't really used it much. Oops. I do find it strange that, uh... There isn't really a big difference between Frieden and Will. Like, there's not a huge advantage to using Frieden. I mean, like, the range is nice. So, I'll give him credit. But beyond that, it's just kind of like, eh, whatever. Can you quit it? I'm getting real tired of these exploding variety snakes. Can I, can I use the Dark Fire to kill you? Oh, yeah. That is a lot of damage, actually. Okay. I take it back. I'm being a big old wiener about it. Frieden. Having, just having that attack by itself is enough to warrant the price of admission here. Oop, run, 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 run. We almost have one full bar of HPs. Viewers, do we love that? I don't know how many more HP upgraders would I need before that, or if it's like a um, like a gem the jeweler kind of thing. Also, these ones don't hurt you. So clearly the backside of the Sky Garden is where all the wieners live, a bunch of turd burglars. They're the ones that are causing me problems. Rumpy. Clearly things that are orange and explodey. Is this an upgrade? Strength upgrade. STR. Okay. I feel like we're making pretty good time here. Yeah, this is a pretty long dungeon. Um, up to this point in the game. So I'm just going to warn you. This isn't, this isn't that bad. It's annoying because it's like... I don't know, tedious? Oh, whoa, excuse you, get out of the way. I was not expecting to have to fight 17 of you at the same time. Jeez! And I did not kill that last one. I wonder if the explosions are capable of nuking each other. But anyway, um, yeah, so this is, for this part of the game, you know, it starts to ramp up a little bit. And I'm not talking about ramping up in terms of difficulty. It's more of just like length and tediousness, tedium. The monotony is, of course, ever-present. So, just get used to that. It's just a lot. There's another chest up here. More of these... Ooh, health upgrade? <gasps> HP power. Why does it call it power? It's not hit power. It's hit points. Hit points. 
Alright, can you stop? This looks like a screensaver on Windows. Alright, what is this? <gasps> is this another one of the crystals? We found the crystal ball! Cool. Oh, I was doing so good about not taking damages too. And then I gosh dang goofed. All right. And with great games come great game design. Of course, the way back is not obnoxious to do in the slightest. You don't have to retrace your steps a whole butt ton. Yeah, this is the, this is the part about this dungeon that really sucks. Which, you know, of all the things to complain about. It's not really a huge deal, but it is a little, once again, the tedium. And this dungeon, I don't I don't remember in the grand scheme of this game how bad this one is in comparison to the others. I think the dungeon that happens directly after this one, if I'm correct, is real bad about it. So, if you thought I was complaining a lot here, right, let's see what freedom looks like sliding side to side. That's, does he have eyeballs? You can't really, I don't know. Maybe his eyes are sunken into his face, I can't tell. All right, doesn't matter. It is time for a crystal ball number two. Set that baby in the hole. So as you can see, it's even odds. We have put in one in four, or not even odds. That is not how that makes sense at all. It is opposite, so we've done one in four. I'm gonna record what we're doing. Still have not used any live so far. Pretty good. Okay. And then, uh, yeah. Next time, we'll be heading down the southwest path to finish up the Sky Garden. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D Mike. This has been Super Nintendo Sunday's Illusion of Gaia. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.